Mheshimiwa Rais, Mheshimiwa Naibu wa Rais, viongozi wenzangu na wananchi wa Kajado amjambo. Amjambo tena. Mheshimiwa Rais, uh, kazi yenye tunafanya hapa imewezekana kwa sababu ya usaidizi ama kuungana kwa watu wengi. Ningependa kukujulisha wale ambao tuko nao hapa tuko na chairman wa Kenya Railway tayari board tayari ameshaongea ningependa kuwaomba board members wake wote wasimame board members ya Kenya Railway wote wasimame tuwapikie makofi asante sana uh, uh, it's a very interesting uh, arrangement your excellency ceo wa KPA ni board member ya KRC na CEO wa KRC ni board member wa KPA because it was one institution before. Tuko pia hapa na uh, PS wetu. I uh, no, first of all tuko na CEO sasa wa Kenya Railway bwana Philip Mainga na senior staff wa Kenya Railway simameni penye mko tuwa 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 shukuru. Pigieni hawa makofi. Hao ndio wanafanya kazi nyingi. Sisi ndio tunachukua the uh, credit lakini wao ndio wako kwa ground huko wakipambana ya mwisho tuko na PS wetu PS Mohamed Daka ambaye pia your excellency is the accounting officer for the ro, uh, railway development levy na without his uh, hard work hatungekuwa tumefikia hapa pigieni PS Makofi asante sana tuko na uh, viongozi wengine kutoka tabaka mbalimbali ya serikali tunawashukuru kwa kuwa nasi Siku ya leo your excellency ningependa kusema machache kwanza na kushukuru wewe na naibu rais kwa kukuja leo kushukua na sisi mara nyingi kwa wizara yangu sipati nafasi tukae kwa tent kama hii e, tunakuwaga tujui ya gari so leo tumepata organized uh, meeting moja imefanywa na railway ya pili ningesema kwamba uh, tutashukuru kazi yenye tumefanya katika hii ministry ni uh, read this department your excellency is that tumeweza ku link SGR na MGR kwa Naivasha na imesaidia kuharakisha mziko yenye inatoka Mombasa kufika Uganda kupitia Malaba nilikuwa uh, ali this year na mkutano na waziri wa kutoka Uganda tukasaidiana kuhakikisha kwamba ile wagons ya kutoka Uganda inaesapita Malaba bila ile vikwaso ilikuwa hapo na kwa sababu hiyo mzigo yenye imetoka Mombasa kwenda Uganda na kupita ya transit na yote yenye imebebwa kwa SGR imeenda juu hivi sasa mwaka huu tumetoka juzi tulikuwa 4.8 million tons sasa tumefika 7.1 million tons na tunafikia mwisho ya mwaka huu tutakuwa tumefika 8 million tons 8 actually we are targeting 8.2 million tons of cargo going through the SGR we believe in a short while your excellency this side of the uh, uh, transport side will be even better kwa ile connection tutafanya tuko na mpango ya kufanya between KRC na Kenya Ports Authority tunataka sasa tuhakikishe kwamba tuna deliver mzigo especially hapa kwa nchi yetu to the last mile mzigo iki, when you order your luggage ama your cargo as a, as a importer tunataka kukuletea mpaka your own shop kama ni thika tunaleta hapo kama ni nakuru tunakufikishia that will make our transport logistic system even more organized your excellency unajua ulipofika ofisi kazi ya kwanza ulifanya ni kutuokoa kwa ile Nairobi Railway City. Unajua ile financing ilikuwa kwa, kwa, kwa UK government ilikuwa karibu irudishwe. Wewe mwenyewe uliongea na Prime Minister wa UK mkiwa Shamal Sheikh na ukahakikisha umetuita pamoja. Sasa tunamalizia master plan ya Nairobi Railway City inaisha mwezi huu. Mwaka kesho kutoka Januari ambaye ni wiki chache iko mbele tutaanza ujenzi ya Nairobi master plan. Na ile plan yako ya kuhakikisha vijana wetu waandikwe kazi during the construction period will now be a reality because we are going to construct the uh, uh, the uh, terminal the central uh, Nairobi central terminal pamoja na the other works that are going to go on there your excellency peer this connection tunafanya leo ya kutoka riruta ikuje bulbul hapa ikuje karen bulbul na ikuje ngong ni mpango ni kadi ya mpango yetu ya kuma 
ku, ku implement Nairobi Master Plan. Nairobi Master Plan, Your Excellency, inahitaji kufikisha wananchi wetu wafike kwa, kwa uh, factories, wafike kwa kaza, kwa town, na wakuje penye wanalala. Hapa Kajado is now the uh, bedroom of the Nairobi city. We want to make sure that your housing project is properly supported by having a railway network, a transport network that makes it cheaper for our people to go to the city. In fact, Your Excellency, we will not stop at it here. We want to go to Kiserian and go to Rongai and take a corner to go back to Galeria and to town, according to your instructions, Your Excellency, so that we make sure that transport network here is a bit uh, more organized. I don't want to say more than that. I want to say, Your Excellency, as uh, for the first time under your administration, Tumepeleka goods kutoka Mombasa mpaka Mwanza kupitia MV Uhuru ile meli tuko nayo kwa uh, uh, um, Lake Victoria for the first time we have docked in Mwanza your excellency and so that means that our volume ya cargo itaweza kusonga mbele your excellency Nairobi master plan, uh, Nairobi railway city inafuatwa na Eldoret railway city na tutatoka hapo tutaenda na Kuru railway city tutaenda Mombasa railway city what we want to do the old railway land we want to regenerate and uh, put housing plan to make sure that to go to your housing to go to your development to make sure that this country is going to be able to move fo forward your excellency i agree with the leaders who have said here as we construct we want we have told the contractors who are here we must as much as possible make sure that we open doors for some manual work to help our young people who are jobless to get a job so that during the construction period in this one year we will be able to employ a good number of kenyans who are going to, to, to have this uh, uh, resource in their own pocket. Your Excellency, what we think is that we have to do a lot of work in the work. We have to do a lot of It's evacuating 35 million tons of cargo from when we came in about 30 million tons. To have to do 1.4 million TUs. We are now approaching 1.7 million TUs. The efficiency of the port and the efficiency of the railway under your leadership. In fact, Your Excellency, kuna watu wengi walikuwa na waziwazi siku ile ulitangaza ukasema si lazima utumie SGR. You can use the road, you can use other means to transport your goods. It was in our manifesto. And the first thing you did, you announced that we want to have freedom of transport. Even with that freedom of transport, the railway has transported far much more cargo because now there is a good competition between the railway and the road. And so, Your Excellency, we are working. The, 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 this ministry is working, and I want to thank all our supporters here, the peers and the staff who are working. I wanted to, I forgot to uh, introduce Namata. I, I would like to request Namata board because they are an integral part of the transport system in the city. And thank you, Your Excellency, that's our now substantively have a DG in Namata. We made sure that he was appointed recently, and I want to thank the board for doing a good job. What we will do beside this is the BRT system. I want to thank you again because you have supported us. The contractor will go back to construction in January to make sure that we construct line one of the BRT system so that it can become an example of move, ma, mass movement of the people. How transport is supporting bottom-up economic uh, development? Ile Tuliubiri, a deputy president, like to say this, Pesa Mfukoni, many, of, uh, many a time. If we are going to reduce the transport, mutu anatumia 200 shillings here kutoka hapa kuenda town, na sasa true railway atatumia shilingi miyamoja, ataweka your excellency shilingi miyamoja kwa mfuko. Na kwa mwezi, kama kila siku anasave 100 shillings, kwa mwezi atasave 3,000 shillings. 3,000 shillings is a lot of money that can be able to help and support a family. Your excellency, peer bottom up in a support kwa sababu, tunakikisha peer we are going to deal with the question of employment. Watu wetu wengi kutoka ngonga hapa wanakanyaka mgu mbaka town kwa kikisha wamepata kazi. Wenye wanafanya kazi current na town, sasa they will not need to walk, they will be able to be transported. So our people will move from walking to a proper mass transport. And I want to say that the transport system is going to support us in that regard. I don't want to say more than that. The road issues, uh, I don't want to see my friend George. George who used to be my neighbor. Uh, 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 we used to live in the same estate, Your Excellency, when we came to Bunge, and I don't want, I don't want him with my, with my friend Onesmus. Wakwe uh, wanapigana, kwa sababu shida yao kidogo ni infrastructure na kazi kidogo. So ile barabara ya, ile barabara, wajane na jalasa kwa sawa, jalasa ni mutu yangu, relax, wewe. 
ile barabara ya kwenda kutoka hapa kwenda eh, suswa eh, nataka tumalize haraka it's only 7 kilometers ndio hao wajumbe wawili watakuwa wanatembeleana ya excellence so instead of delaying hata ile pesa ningeweka upande mwingine nitaenda kuongea na kera tumalize hiyo barabara haraka ndio hao wakitembeleana sana watakuwa wanapendana zaidi na kuunganisha watu wa sehemu hii your excellence i want to thank also mheshimiwa jelas na mheshimiwa uh, kj both of them are beneficiary of this program na mheshimiwa jelas is doing a very good job as our mp of karen and Nea environment we want to thank you for the job you are doing it is now my singular duty and pleasure and privilege kukaribisha man riki g yeah Muliona Rikiji juzi kwa Youth Connect. Yeah. Sa na nakaa 16. <laughs> to begin uh, Makofi, our Deputy President, Rigadi Kashakwa. Akuje anene machache na kukaribisha rice.